Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Now Dive TV. In this short episode I'd like to show you that your harness straps, your shoulder straps in particular, should not be too tight. The stability from your set in a DIR harness setup should come from your waist strap together with your crotch strap. So let's dive right in and look at the video. Here you can see I'm wearing a DIR harness and the straps are just right. When I stretch out my right arm it should just tighten up. Not completely, but just tighten up. The D-rings are in the right position when you can touch them with your thumbs easily like I just did there. Now let's look when everything is in place as it normally should be. Obviously when you go on upside down everything stays in place. The air in your wing will shift around a little bit, you need to compensate for this, but that's normal. Here I take my arms out of the straps to show you when I move around the set will stay roughly at the same spot. Nothing on my shoulders, just a long hose going around my neck and the set is attached to my hips and with the crotch strap and the hip strap. As you can see upside down the set goes away from my back just a little bit and flipping back around it just sits on my shoulders. That little shrug you see me doing is balancing the tank on my back and that's a little trick everyone should learn regardless of the setup. Because the tank is always heavy and always wants to shift around. Here you can see scrouching everything. The set is perfectly in place just by the scrotch strap and the waist strap. Here you can see that little corrective scrouch again. Now put the arms back and everything is in place. So again I hope this video shows you that it's not necessary to tighten those um, shoulder straps all the way down so you restrict the blood flow to your arms. Happy days guys, see you out there. 